happy to have Al back in Studio 1A this morning, less than two weeks after knee replacement surgery. The question is, how are you feeling? Well, mm -hmm. I'm feeling okay. I mean, a little ouchy, but uh, for the most part, I feel better than when I went in. So that's the most okay. important part. Technology and procedures have come such a long way. Doctors want you back up and moving as soon as possible. And that meant house calls from one tough physical therapist. You'd think that if you get knee replacement surgery, at least you'd get a little rest, right? Wrong. Not the case when your physical therapist is a six foot four former college linebacker, Billy Campbell of the Visiting Nurse Service of New York. Well, I'll try to be as gentle as possible. Uh, since when? He measures my progress. How far can I bend my knee? Three. Good. One thirteen. Excellent. I'm gonna remove all those bone spurs. Remember, I had that right knee totally replaced less than two weeks ago. We focus on three things to get me back and moving. First, strength. We're trying to get that last bit of extension in the knee and get these quadricep muscles to fire nice and strong. This will help keep your knee from buckling when you walk. Billy puts me through a series of exercises. Two. Next thing we focus on, balance. This makes sure I can move around safely. If you're not stable on one leg, guess what? You're not yeah. stable walking. Finally, agility, combining strength and balance. So with a new prosthetic knee, your brain and your knee don't talk to each other. And so it doesn't know that there's something not there. Right. Some fencing style lunges, and we're ready to take a stab at the stairs. Good thing, because I live in a brownstone with plenty of stairs at home and at work. Beautiful. Billy says I'm not doing too badly. There's not a lot of people this uh, early on after knee surgery that can do some of the things that he's doing, like the step ups on the stairs. Then after Billy's session is over, it's time to ice that leg with a high tech cold compression machine. My new best friend. Ooh, ice, ice baby. Again, the painkiller's kicking in. <laughs> uh, the, it's really interesting because they do get you up right away. Yeah. Uh, and now I'll transition to uh, outpatient uh, physical therapy, so three to four days a week. But that's the most important, you know, the rehab and the physical therapy. You had your other knee replaced, what, 15 years, 15 ago. years ago? Is it a huge difference in yeah, terms I was, of I was the in procedure? the hospital 11 days. I was out of work for almost a month. Uh, so, it, But I had some other mitigating circumstances. But this is completely different. But you've been in great shape. I bet yeah. you that recovery made it easier because you're always on your bike yeah, you're always yeah. doing yeah. stuff right well it's it's been it's been a fun transition but uh, I, I can honestly say I feel much better now than I did when I before I went oh, yes. all right Al thanks very much hello today fans thanks for checking out our YouTube channel subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews show highlights and digital exclusives